Hi everyone, the objectives of this video are to define fracture toughness, we're then going to learn about the ductile to brittle temperature, we're going to have a look at crack propagation and the formula for that, and then we're going to learn the formula for fracture toughness. Okay, so what is fracture toughness? Well, fracture toughness is a measure of the energy absorbed before failure occurs. So each material has an inherent fracture toughness, an amount of energy that it can take before failure occurs. And we can relate this to the crack size, because depending on how big the crack is, we can then tell how much force a material can take. Okay, so before we start with that, let's have a look at the ductile to brittle transition temperature. So this is a temperature in which a BCC material transitions from a ductile fracture to a brittle fracture. So if you can see here on this image to the right, we have a measure of temperature on the bottom and energy absorbed, so the fracture toughness, is going to be on the y-axis. And as you can see, initially it's going through a ductile zone and then very quickly what happened is with this at a certain temperature, we've seen a very quick drop in the energy that it can absorb the fracture toughness of material. So whereas initially it was going to experience a ductile fracture, which we much prefer, as we can see physical warning, it's very quickly moved into a brittle fracture, which is catastrophic, as you know. So it's critical to stay above the ductile to brittle temperature in order to avoid catastrophic failure. So the classic example of this is, of course, the Titanic, where essentially it cooled down so quickly from the ice water, it suddenly experienced a brittle fracture. 